Let's go down to Ellis with a great event happening next weekend. Take it away, Ellis. Yes, very excited about this one. Imagine growing up in today's technology-driven world and not having access to a computer at home. For many San Diego children, that's an unfortunate reality. But now a nonprofit called Computers to SD Kids is turning what many people see as trash into rich educational machines. We here at San Diego 6 are partnering with them on a special event, and we're inviting all of you to help change kids' lives at no cost to you. Here to explain, the co-founder of Computers to SD Kids, Larry Hirschfield, an event co-organizer, Justin Levine, and the event sponsor, uh, Gary Levine of GS Levine Insurance. Gentlemen, thanks so much for being here. We've been working hard on this for a long time, so we're really excited to talk about it. Now, first to you, Larry, you founded this organization with your wife, Tammy. Kind of, what is it about, what is it for people who haven't heard? So, uh, Tammy, my wife, and I founded uh, Computers to SD Kids in late 2004. Uh, we wanted to be sure that, that kids that otherwise couldn't afford a computer that are trying to grow up in this very technology-driven world would have a chance to have a computer in their home. And so we partner with individuals, and particularly with large corporations, that give us computers. For example, Sharp Hospital gives us as many as 1,500 computers a year. We refurbish them. Um, and then we give them to, to kids that otherwise couldn't afford them. This year we'll give almost 3,000 computers to children that otherwise would not have access to a computer. And it's a really important thing because it, it's illegal to throw away your computers, right? And uh, sometimes we've seen some, some reports of some companies that where they become toxic waste in some places in Asia and are sold for parts, really bad stuff. There's also companies that do it well. But this allows it to keep staying in San Diego and go straight to the kids. And we've seen some of the photos up on the screen of some past drives where yeah. we've seen this. I'm talking about what kind of impact it's had on people's lives. It's, it's, it's really, really terrific. When, when, when folks come, pick up computers, their, their parents come, sometimes their teachers come, and you can just see the, the enthusiasm and the relief these, these parents have that their kids will finally have access to a computer. And we get letters. We got one letter from a mom who said that her daughter had been failing. When she finally got a computer in her home and could do homework <laughs> at home, she raised that grade to a B plus. And for her, that's terrific. And for that kid, it's terrific, and we, we have all sorts of responses like that. And think about what a societal difference this could have in such an easy thing. Now, Justin's a, a longtime friend of mine, and he told me about this and told me about you guys, and we talked about and brainstormed kind of what we could do as San Diego Six family to kind of make a special event next week, and we've got really something special planned next week, don't right, we, Justin? You're exactly right, Alex. We're very excited for next week. It's going to be a great event. We're passing out over 300 computers to families throughout San Diego. And we're also providing an opportunity for businesses and other families to come in, drop off their electronics, and put it to really good use. And you can drop off just about anything. It's not just computers. You can drop off computers, uh, TVs, radios, uh, and, and software. And the great thing here is it could be working or non-working, right? Which makes a huge difference for, for what you do. And so we're going to be having both of those things happening at the same time. And Brooke's going to be out there live, and you guys are going to be out there live as well. Right. Yeah, we're really excited for it. And, and a, 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 a way that this event is happening is because of, of Gary's great um, contributions to help it. Justin, I know you work uh, with Northwestern doing life insurance. Gary, you work in the insurance company as well. And, and companies are such an important part. He's talked about some, some stuff that Sharp does. Why are you getting involved, and what are you going to be doing with your company? Well, Alex, um, this is really fun because we can actually give away our old computers that normally we didn't know what to do with. We were keeping them for parts. We didn't, we didn't know really how to dispose of them. And we can give back to the community now with, um, with really joy and know that we're making a contribution. And our old computers are going to go and, and, um, and be placed with kids that wouldn't normally have computers. Now, one concern for people that are business owners, because we're asking them to, to donate and individuals, is what about the security? But this is an important point as well. So if I could, I'd like to make two points. First, we, we, the security aspect is very, very important to folks that give us computers. So we are very focused on that. We use the same software and the same processes that the US Department of Defense uses to ensure its systems are, are, are completely wiped free of any data. And we do a very good job of that. The other thing I'd like to add is that if, if there are corporations out there that have computers that they'd like to, to consider giving to us, we can provide the transport. Uh, I'll, I'll put a plug for our friend David Wax. His company, Waxy Sanitary, provides the transport at no cost to these companies. 
So we would be happy to pick up computers from Excellent. Companies. And so again, we're asking people to come out to your warehouse, the address we saw on the screen, next week, 8 to 10. Brooke's going to be out there live. We uh, thank you guys for joining us and talking about this. We look forward to it. We also want to add that the kids who are going to receive the computers next week have already been chosen from the wait list. But to get on that wait list in the future or for more information on how you can donate next week, go to sandiego6.com, click on Hot Topics. Gentlemen, we'll see you next week. Thanks for being here, and thanks for all the good work you do.